Hello, my name is Amy Ecker. Welcome to my channel. Today we're doing an all day wear test using the primer, the setting spray, and the foundation. How do these three babies work together? Should you buy them? Should you not? Did it last 14 hours? Let's find okay, out. Okay, we're gonna start with the cooling matte primer infused with peach and sweet big cream. All right, let's see how this primer does. It's a little peachy, a little peachy. Usually I don't like to use cream primers overall until winter because they typically still make my makeup slide. This one absorbed extremely fast into the skin, which I probably could have used another pump or two. And it smells lovely. Okay, now we're gonna go with the Peach Perfect 14 hour wear foundation. Hmm, let's see how this baby does. And I don't remember what color I got, light beige. Again, I ordered online, so this is gonna be a new experience for both of us at the same time. Sometimes I hit it good, sometimes I don't. Okay, pretty color, pretty, oop, pretty color, pretty color. Definitely a full coverage foundation, which is nice. It's nice for me, being that I have all those little red spots and patches and dots and spots. Now let's see what my initial impression is after using that brush. I might need to buff it out a little bit. Overall, it did pretty well. I mean, I still see some of my patches here. I would probably call this a medium to full coverage foundation, but it, it looks really, really nice. So we're gonna keep going with this. And I'm gonna go ahead and apply the Peach Blur Powder now. And then I'm going to use the setting foundation or setting spray now before I apply most of my makeup. And then by end of day, of course, we're gonna see how well this wore. And did peach, did the Too Faced Peach and Cream work as well as some of my other favorite foundations? Okay, that smells lovely. That, that peach mist smells lovely. That's all I'm gonna say. Okay, I'm gonna put on the rest of my makeup and then we're gonna do an all day wear test and see how this baby okay, performs. Okay, so it's the end of the day for the all day wear test on the Too Faced foundation. I put it on, let's see, it's been, Okay, so I it's the end of a very long work day, so I've had this foundation on for exactly 14 and a half hours. And so how do I feel about this foundation? Let's look. So overall, I'm, I'm impressed with the foundation uh, for 14 hours. I do have a bit of separation on my nose on the edges, a little bit there. It's kind of a little bit mottled on my chin. Not surprising, my nose and chin. This is a zoom lens. Um, my nose and chin is always my problem areas. It, it has lightened up on my face overall. The oils have come through. But really and truthfully, I think, you know, for 14 and a half hours, it didn't do bad. It actually did pretty good. And the fact that, again, I didn't blot, I didn't touch up, I didn't do any of that. I made the foundation, the Too Faced primer and setting spray work. And overall, I will say, as much as I touched my face today, because it was, it was a stressful day, y'all. It was a stressful day. Um, as much as I touched my face or put my head on my chin, I really expected my foundation to be way worse than it is. And overall, um, like I said, I'm, I'm pretty impressed with how well it held up. So I'm kind of interested if, in what your opinions are. Have you tried this foundation? Are you having luck with it? Are you not? 
I'm actually going to try this again tomorrow and, and use my other, can't speak. I'm going to try this again tomorrow using my Scandinavia primer and setting spray and see if I've got any, any different results. So we'll see how that goes. But anyways, I look forward to hearing from you. Thank you so much for watching this video doing the all day wear test. And I am using the primer, the foundation and the setting spray. So we're going to see how these did. I'm sorry. You've already seen how these did. This is the end of the video. Hello. <laughs> it's, it's an early morning. What can I say? Um, anyways, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any thoughts or questions, please leave those in the comments below. And I look forward to hearing from you and what your thoughts are. So thank you so much for watching. I appreciate you joining my channel. It's, um, it's always a pleasure to hear your guys' feedback or I, I've really enjoyed some of the friendships that I've gained from YouTube. So anyways, I hope you all have a wonderful day and you've got a choice, so make it a great one. 